I'm fed up with all this your excuse making. I'm fed up. For the past years, we've been spending a lot of money. I'm tired. We've been waiting for the past 10 good years. Dear, my own, please let's not allow this to break our love and what God is about to do for us in our lives and not allow God to have his cause. I believe, I believe that... You believe what? For all these years, you still believe what? I'm done. Listen, I'm going to work. By the time I come back, I don't want to see you here. I'm done with all this. You've overstayed your welcome. Thank you. I'm sorry, it's just I'm not in a good mood at all. Do you feel like talking about it? Maybe, maybe not today, some other day. Oh, it's okay. It's okay, my dear. Just check your WhatsApp. I sent you a powerful message of a man. Responsibilities. We were on our social show from uh, Psalm 21 that God is our shepherd and that we should not lack, we ought not to lack guidance, we ought not to lack protection, we ought not to lack provision. I want to thank you because thy word has gone up by your spirit. And there are very many circumstances that are in the lives of the people. And then the circumstances, some of them, many of them are obnoxious. They make for sorrow. But the people have listened unto the fact that God is under obligation to do, even to bless. Necessity is laid upon him. And so now, Lord in glory, I release by the Spirit of God the blessing that came upon Joseph, upon all the Josephs of the present day, in the name of Jesus Christ. There is nothing too hard for you to do. I know that I will call upon you in the day of my distress and you will answer me. Lord, your word says there shall be no barrier in the land. <laughs> Lord, you said increase multiply and replenish the earth. Lord, I thank you because I'm going to have my 
my children in this life and not in the life after. I break every power from the pit of hell fighting against my marriage. Lord, I thank you because you are restoring this marriage to become a harmonious one indeed. I thank you because that is the necessity that is in the heart of the Lord to do for me. Lord, I thank you, gracious Lord. I give you all the praise. Lord, I thank you. Ah, Lord, I worship your holy name. Ah, God, I thank you because nothing is hard for you to do. Lord, I give you all the praise. Lord, I give you all the thanks. Lord, I say, take all the glory. Precious Lord, in Jesus' name. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Just ask God, I give you the praise. Thank you. Yes, come in. The door is open. Welcome, my daughter. Please have your seat. Thank you, Father. How may I help you? Why are you here? Father, troubles have come past me around. My heart is overwhelmed. And there is none to come to my rescue. The enemy has lifted up his heels against me and I am tired of moving on. Well, my daughter Rebecca, eyes have not seen, ears have not heard. It has not come into the heart of any man the things that I have in store for those that love me. Rebecca, my daughter, do you truly love me? But Father, I go to church regularly. I'm also a worker. I pay my tithes. I help the needy. Rebecca, my daughter, do you truly love me? Hello, good evening, Mabel. How are you? Hello, Becky, Becky. <laughs> how are you? I'm fine, I'm fine. How is everything? Wonderful. And let me tell you what. Please, what? Good news for you. Talk to me. <laughs> you know that my project. Okay, yes. That I've been studying for for so long. I went for the exam yesterday. 
Wow, congratulations! Thank you so much. We need to celebrate this, please. Yes, we need to pop champagne. Oh my, my. Yeah, what a great achievement. You know, that's a great achievement, Mabel. Yes, it is, it is. No, 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 I'm really happy for you. I know you are. Thank you. You're welcome. You know what, Mabel? I even called you to tell you something more. A greater achievement to crown up this achievement you got. Okay. Yeah. I just called to tell you about the love of Jesus and, you know, Rebecca. how he died for you. Rebecca. You know. Spare me the long story. Mm -hmm. uh -uh. I even thought you wanted to talk to me about something more serious, like our normal gist. Listen. You know I believe in God and that's okay for me. Besides, I'm not faced with the kind of troubles you and your husband, I'm sorry to say, but I'm not faced with the kind of trouble you and your husband are going through. See, when you have something more serious, like our normal gist, going out to catch up with our other friends, you know, gossip and all of that stuff, you can call me, okay? So. Rebecca. Yes, Daddy. Rebecca. Yes, Daddy. Rebecca, my daughter. Yes, Lord. I have one last request to make. Do this for me. My word is sick, and her inhabitants perish every day. I need you to tell them that I died for them and that I still love them. This is the urgent need of the Father. Why did I talk to her that way? Why? 
The other day we quarreled and we've just been quarreling. Gosh. Lord, I'm sorry. God, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. If I get home, I'll tell her I'm sorry. Oh, God. Sorry for what happened the other day. Please forgive me. Please, no. I'm, I'm sorry. No, please, for what that's happened. not gotten to that. Please. I'm, I'm really sorry. You won't, no, you won't just, understand just what I'm going get through. Up, please. I've been having a lot of pressures of late. My family, my mom, even some friends, you know, who make mockery of me. Because of this situation we are having, we are, we are facing. I'm really sorry. Please forgive me. I will, I will believe God together with you. And I will trust that God will do it. I, don't, I won't allow this to happen again. It's okay. It's okay. Just get up, please. My dear, it's okay. I understand you. I really understand you. And I know that God is going to help us. I definitely know that. Let's pray. Okay. Father, we believe you in the midst of our storm lord the the storm is is so hard the storm is coming at us in a strong way but we believe you we trust you for what you are going to do lord in our trying times lord we will put our trust in you we will put our faith in you thank you father because i know you are going to do it yes, lord. in jesus name we pray amen amen, amen. amen. all right let me go and my change my clothes yes yes come back for your dinner <laughs>